Hi, I'm Sam Thurgood and welcome to my two minute parasha. In this week's Sidra of Yitro, building up to the giving of the Torah, Hashem makes a special declaration to the Jewish people. Vayitem li segula ki li kola aret. For you will be a segula to me, for all the world is mine. What exactly does this word segula mean and what does it mean for the Jewish people to be Hashem's segula? We'll be exploring two different and in fact contradicting views on this. The first is Rashi who says Sugula means treasure. You will be treasured by me more than all of the nations of the earth for all of the world is mine. How does the end of the sentence connect to the beginning? Rashi says if Hashem had no choice, if all Hashem had was one nation and so he chose that one nation, that's not all that significant. Well I chose you, you couldn't have chosen anyone else. No, Hashem owns the entire world. And Hashem chooses us. You will be my treasure from all of the nations, even though hey, I could have chosen any one of them. I've chosen you. You are special. And the others are not so significant to me. The second explanation is that of the Sephorino, who says that this word sugula means, in a sense, you will be my messengers towards the other nations. You will be tasked with bringing my word and my teachings to all of the other nations of the world because even though I love you and I've chosen you, all of the world is mine and I feel a responsibility towards the other nations as well. And here you have the two themes that come up so often in Judaism of particularism and universalism. Rashi speaking about what it means to be beloved by Hashem and to be chosen by Hashem as the Jewish people. And the Sephorino saying what it means to be an agent of Hashem in bringing Hashem's world, word to the wider world. Either way, says Rabbi Hanan Porat, even the Sephorino agrees that it is not our role to be missionaries in the world. Although we find Torah that the Torah will come out to the entire world from Zion, from Jerusalem, that is not necessarily done through us going out, but through nations of the world coming in. For people coming to learn from us, coming to visit and grow, rather than placing the responsibility on us necessarily to uh, go out. So even the Sephorno is not necessarily saying that we must be at street corners handing out pamphlets. The way in which we achieve what we're supposed to achieve is by being an Am Kadosh. Through being a holy nation and through being worthy of Hashem's love, we will then bring the goodness and enlightenment of Hashem to all of the world. Wish you all a Shabbat Shalom.